Welcome to Northern Lights Over Arca. I'm JP and this time I'm retrying Black Widow Aggression against Expert Rhino with the Masters of Evil modular set. Uh, last time I lost to Rhino because Rhino managed to scheme out the act card. So I decided to make some changes into my Black Widow deck. So because I'm running the Masters of Evil modular set, there are a lot of boost abilities on cards. So I decided to add a couple of target acquired into the deck. Also, I found out that I'm not playing the uppercut that much, so I cut one down and actually I'm trying out the skilled strikes from uh, uh, Dr. Strange's pack out how they work so other than that I didn't do many changes to the deck to make room for those new cards I removed the power of aggressions because there are so few two cost or more cost aggression cards that I found that I was rarely getting any use out of the power of aggressions but that's enough of the deck let's see if we can do better this time against rhino so let's get going if you like my content hit the subscribe button so you don't miss anything okay so i have reshuffled the decks and let's see what we draw as our opening hand So we are looking for Black Widow's Gauntlet, we got one, then we got Covered Ops. Also we want some preparation at the start, so we get Target Acquired, Downtime, Strength and Widow's Bite. Okay, um, we're not playing the Covered Ops, we can just mulligan that, I think Downtime can be mulligan too. And uh, Widow's Bite. So let's draw three more cards. See what we get. We get Skill Strike, Dance of Death and Valkyrie. Uh, Valkyrie is actually good because now we have some means to get rid of Breaking and Taking. Okay, so first action. I think I'll play down Valkyrie. I'll use the Strength and... The Dance of Death. Play Valkyrie down. And I'll use Skill Strike to play down Black Widow's Gauntlet. I'll use Black Widow's Gauntlet to play down Target Acquired. Uh, we draw one card. So we get the Silt Suit for next turn. That's really nice. Uh, let's flip to Black Widow and Valkyrie. And Black Widow will thwart the breaking and taking away. So that's our turn. We ready up. And I'll throw up to five. I get a grappling hook. Then I'll get Avengers Mansion, Safe House, and Tigra. And let's go to the villain phase. We add one threat to the main shim. Rhino will attack. I think I'll defend with Black Widow. And 3 plus 2, so 5 minus 2, so I take 3 damage. Encounter card is gang up. And I think I'll need to defend with Valkyrie. And 4 damage, so Valkyrie is defeated. And that's the villain phase. We go to the next hero phase. I think I'll need to play down Tigra. And... 
really want to play. Actually, I think I can can survive maybe one turn. So let's see. If I play down the Sinsuit, I need three. I don't have enough to play the Grappling Hook. Um, same thing if I play Tiger. Yeah, I think uh, the Sint Suit is more needed right now, so I'll play that. I'll use Safe House, Avengers Mansion and Grappling Hook to play it. I'll keep Tiger in hand for maybe play it her next turn. And that's our turn. We ready up and we draw back up to five. So one target acquired, emergency, counter attack. And combat training. We go to the villain phase. We add one threat to the main team. I will defend against the Rhino's attack. So Rhino hits for three damage. I'll defend all of it. And the encounter card is Whirlwind. Whirlwind comes into play. Okay, so that's our villain phase done, so let's go to the next hero phase. Okay, so I think we will we'll use target acquired, emergency and combat training, play down Tigra. We use Actually, we'll just flip and Tigra will thwart for one. And we'll use the gauntlets to play down counter attack. We draw one card, we get the Mockingbird, and that's it. So we ready up, we draw back up to six, so we get Nick Fury, Energy. Skilled Strike, Attack Robotics, and Emergency. Okay. And let's go to the villain phase. We add one threat here. Rhino will thwart. One plus one. We use Emergency, so there's only one added here. Whirlwind will thwart, uh, shim for one also, so there's four of seven now there. And let's see what the encounter card is. It is I'm tough, so Rhino will get the tough status card. Okay, so that's the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. I think the first action will be to play attack robotics down. We draw one card, we get the uppercut. Mm. Nick Fury would be three more cards. Just thinking, could I defeat Whirlwind this turn? I could actually play Mockingbird instead of Nick Fury to stone Rhino. That way, but that won't help a lot against Whirlwind. We could also uppercut. We could save skill strike and not heal with Natasha, but uh, we I think we'll want to heal up. Yeah, I think I'll instead of getting the cards with Nick Fury, I'll play Nick Fury. I'll use energy, uppercut, and skill strike to play. Nick Fury. I deal 4 damage to Whirlwind. And I'll just keep Mockingbird in hand. I'll heal up with Natasha. I'll flip to Black Widow. Tigra will hit and defeat Whirlwind. 
and heals one and takes one consequential damage. Nick Fury will thwart for two. And that's our turn. So upkeep we draw Winter Soldier, but Acrobatics, Counterattack, and Genius. And let's remember to ready up. Okay. That's the hero phase done. Let's go to the villain phase. So Rhino attacks. Nick Fury will defend. Rhino hits for 3 plus 1, so 4 damage. Nick Fury is defeated. Encounter card is I'm tough. So this card gains surge. And advance. So Rhino schemes. And 1 plus 1, so 2 threat will be added to the seam. Okay, so that's the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. Well, first thing I'll use Black Widow's Gauntlet to play another attack robotics. Now Winter Soldier becomes free to play because I have four preparations. I'll play Winter Soldier. I will also use Genius and Counter Attack to play Mockingbird. And this adds a stun to Rhino. And Mockingbird will hit for one, removing the tough. Winter, Winter Soldier hits for two. Tigra hits for two. And Black Widow hits for two. Like so. And that's our hero phase done. We go to upkeep. Five cards ready up. And add the consequential damage to Winter Soldier 2. And Mockingbird. Actually, I'll backtrack a little bit. I Rather than I hit with Black Widow, I will thwart for 2. That is just because if we hit another advance, we don't lose right straight away for that. Okay, so let's see what we got. We get a Hulk, Skill Strike, another Black Widow's Gauntlet, Counter-Attack and Widow's Bite. And we go to Villain Phase, we add one threat to the main team. Rhino tries to attack but is stunned, so we rem remove the stun. Encounter card is hard to keep down, so Rhino heals 4 damage. So we're back where we started with Rhino's health. Okay, at least uh, we didn't get any extra threat or anything like that. So that's the villain phase, let's go to the next hero phase. Uh, first action, I'll use counter attack to play down Black Widow's other gauntlet. Mm. I think Mockingbird will just ward for one. Uh, Black Widow will... Uh, no, uh, first thing, I'll play down Widow's Bite. Then I'll use Skill Strike and hit for four. And Winter Soldier will hit for two. So I grab on hit. Uh, actually, we could just hit with Tigra. We could play Hulk next turn. So Tigra will hit for two damage. And that's our turn. We're ready up. 
we draw back up to five. Espionage, covered ops, uppercut, and espionage. Okay. So the villain phase starts. We add one threat to the main team. Rhino will attack. The Mockingbird will defend. Rhino hits for five damage. The Mockingbird is defeated, and we get an encounter card, which is enhanced ivory horn. So Rhino gets plus one attack. So that's the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. I'll play down both of the espionages with uh, Black Widow's Gauntlets. And I think I'll play down Hulk. And before I do anything else, I'll try to hit with Hulk. So, 3 damage. And let's see what we get. We get an energy, so one damage to every character. That means uh, Winter Soldier won't be attacking. Black Widow will thwart for two. Okay, so that's our hero phase done. We ready up. And we drop back up to five. And we get an extra encounter card. Let's shuffle the deck. And we get covered ops. Counter attack. Uppercut. And dance of death. So I think we'll start burning down Rhino from now on. Uh, villain phase starts. We add one threat here. Rhino attacks, I'll defend with Black Widow. And we take one damage. I think I'll trigger counter attack so I can ready. I deal one damage to Rhino and I deal one damage with the Widowmaker ability. Encounter card. The first one is. Melter, we trigger Widow's Bite, we deal 2 damage to Melter, and we also stun Melter, and we deal 1, yeah we deal the 1 damage already, the other card is Masters of Evil, so we add one acceleration token. There is three threat here. And we discard cards until we draw until we get a Masters of Evil minion. So uh, we get radioactive man. So those guys are in play. And that's the villain phase. So let's go to the next hero phase. Okay, so the match is getting quite interesting. I think uh, rather than burning down Rhino just yet, we'll opt to. Oh, yeah, Sinsuit would have exhausted because we read it, Black Widow. But uh, anyway, mm, I'll play down. Grappling hood with the Black Widow's gauntlets, and as I was saying, I think we need to before we start burning down Rhino, we need to deal with these guys. Uh, well, first thing I will do is hit. Uh, I think I'll hit Radioactive Man with Winter Soldier, so two damage. Hulk will hit. Radioactive man. So five damage there. And we get Widow's Bite and it has an energy. So everything takes one damage. So 
that also flips Rhino to phase 3. So let's see that first. So Rhino can stuff. There are 16 health on Rhino. Then Hulk takes 2 damage total. Black Widow takes 1 damage and Melter takes 1 damage. And also Radioactive Man takes 1 damage. So what I think I will do is I'll play Dance of Death. That way I can remove the top, defeat Melter, do 3 damage to Rhino and finish up Radioactive Man with the rest. Yeah. Okay, that sounds like a good plan. We still are not that far here. So I think we can manage one turn without warding. Okay, so cover tops, counter attack and uppercut for dance of death. First damage goes to Rhino, so top is removed. Two damage go to Melter. So Melter is defeated. And the three damage goes to Rhino. And Black Widow will hit the Radioactive Man, defeating Radioactive Man. And that's our turn, so we're ready up. I think Hulk will just defend this turn. We draw back up to 5. We get Skill Strike, Mockingbird, another Skill Strike, and another Skill Strike, and Nick Fury. <laughs> well, we could make a really big hit with Black Widow, so I can boost boost the attack by 6 yeah that's just just interesting okay so uh, we add one threat to the main scheme actually we have two because we have the acceleration token rhino attacks uh, I'll defend with black widow uh, we get one Boost icon, so Rhino hits for 5. Mm, let's see. So, actually Rhino hits for a total of 6. I'll defend 3 of it. But I'll use Attacrobatics to cancel that one boost icon and deal the, that one damage back. I'll also use Shinsu to ready up Black Widow. And then I'll use Widow Maker. But still I take 2 damage. Yeah. And I will also... Yeah, I, I don't have counter attack anymore. Okay, and the encounter card is per notice. Um, discard preparation card you control with the highest cost if you cannot discard against search. So it will just discard grappling hook. We don't have time to go to. Alter Ego just now, unfortunately. Okay, um, that's the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. Okay, so I was calculating that as Rhino has only 11 health remaining, I just hit him down this turn. So I use all of the skill strikes that boosts our attack up by 
8, uh, 6, so I'm attack of 8. I'll hit for 8. And Hulk will just finish Rhino off. And let's see what Hulk does after that. So after Rhino is defeated, Hulk just says, sod it and goes away. Well, that was quite a thematic ending. So yeah, uh, we managed to beat down Rhino. Expert with uh, Masters of Evil model are set with Black Widow aggression. Uh, the other thing, if I wouldn't have had enough damage to deal with R uh, Rhino this turn, the other path would have been to play Nick Fury and draw some cards and then uh, we could have thwarted and maybe play uppercut and go to alter ego to heal but luckily we had enough damage so this wasn't necessary yeah so that's black widow aggression as i said earlier i'm not a big fan of aggression in solo but it's nice to try out different aspects with different heroes and i think this uh, black widow deck works at least against rhino uh, against the other villains i think there is some tweaking needed but if i'll play play those villains then i'll just tweak the deck a bit and try again but that's the match uh, thanks for watching and until next time